but you have to be willing to understand that every QA role will not be for you for your first one. That's exactly why Rolling QA is designed the way it is, because I want to teach you what you need to land that first one, and we're going to get you in the market because you're you're not going to be proficient at everything, and you have to be willing to accept that. So with us having four students landing jobs this month, that tells you there's still very much opportunity, but you have to be willing to understand that every role won't be for you for your first one, and you have to be willing to understand that depending on your skill levels, you may or may not be as competitive, or you may be competing with more people. I have some people that come in and are like, okay, I want to do manual testing, because you know, that's the buzzword, manual testing. <laughs> Now, you, now that you need to be a QA engineer, <laughs> and now you also have AI inside of QA testing, you also have um, RPA, you also have that, like, there are other skills that you can add to even be more competitive. 